The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all this day. La gracia de nuestro Señor Jesucristo, el amor de Dios y la comunión del Espíritu Santo sean con ustedes este día. We'll spend some time in confession and receiving God's forgiveness as we do each Sunday in Lent, using the words of the prayers that were written for this third Sunday in Lent. I will adapt them a little bit for our context, but the words were striking already for this circumstance. In every moment of our days, extraordinary or mundane, together or apart, walking the dog, caring for our families, reading bedtime stories together, doing the dishes or simply sitting in the living room hearing the news. In every moment, in every place, God is there. Let us, though, confess how often we do not see God in our lives or in our world, especially in how we live them out. Join me in praying. God of eternity, you know how often we travel down the rocky roads of doubt and fear and anxiety. We pester others with our worries and we do damage to our souls with our anxieties. We hurl bitter words at those we love and we keep destructive words on repeat in our heads. We have chances to offer ourselves in service to one another, but only give our contempt to those we struggle or fail to love. We could share the living waters of Christ with the world, but want to store it in jars for safekeeping. Fountain of grace, you turn towards us to meet us wherever we are. You break open the places we fear to show you, so we might be made whole. In Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, our thirst for hope and joy is quenched. Please remember this day to return to the Lord your God, to make that cross of your baptism on your forehead, and remember that God is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love. Hear the word of the gospel and allow it to transform your minds. You are a beloved child of God, fully and completely known, accepted, redeemed, and renewed. May God's call continue to create you. May it continue to create us and lead us into wholeness and life this day. Amen.